All right, guys, we finally made it here. I'm here at the Diamond Tower site, and uh, we got all sorts of good stuff. You can see the, the fiber optic cable up there at the top of it that's coiled up. That's coming in from my upstream provider, and then that goes into the new Ubiquiti AC dish there on the side of the road. Up on that box there, you can see a better view of it. But anyway, I'm gonna get off the road here because there's a car coming. But. We're gonna cruise over here and take and take a look at this. Morning, dude. Hell, there's the dog hanging out up there at the farmhouse. I'm gonna do some speed testing videos for you guys and stuff, so it should be pretty good. Okay, so we're here at the network operating center for the core router and the internet network. So this is where everybody's internet eventually ends up at. That's on IntelLink. So that's pretty cool. This is where all the data goes. We got our cloud core uh, CCR1016 for MicroTIC as the core router. And then I have this other switch that I'm not even using. And then we have, we have that. It's a tough switch. Uh, PoE, it's 24 volt. And then we have the PoE for the new radio. This is the new AC radio, which is acting as the backhaul. It's coming into Ethernet 1 right there. Look, if we actually go here on the screen, and there we go. You know, like that. I'm going to do interfaces. That'll actually give us our throughput for the WAN port, so you guys can actually see that. We're pulling about 30 megabytes download, about 10 megabytes upload right now. Okay. I'm going to set our settings to DHCP so we can also get an address. There we go. See, this is plugged directly into the into the cloud core router through a gigabit Thunderbolt port down there. Okay, so there's a really good result there. Five milliseconds ping, about 265 on the download. Not so hot on the upload, but I'm pretty sure with some cha with some channel changes we can get that taken care of. So. I'll log in here. Okay, we're just going to switch over to a different channel. See what channel it's on now. It's on five seven four five. So we want to pick something different. Let's try this one.
Okay, let's do a speed test on this setting. So it's actually quite a bit better on the upload. I'm just going to change it one more time. Okay, let's try it on this settings. I'm not sure what my computer's doing. So that was the fastest ping time. Okay, we're going to leave it on this setting because this setting seems to be working really good. Getting 220 up, 220 down, that's pretty symmetrical. And this, this link right here is probably only like 300 yards or so. So it, it's, not, it's not that far away. It's on the 23 dB light bridges, or light beams, excuse me. Well, that's good enough for me. there you go I've been hard at work upgrading all this stuff to get it so that way we can all get the fastest speeds possible for our internet and I'm really excited to be able to do this for you guys and just hang tight and you'll see the speed soon thanks